don't really see many Sonics in SoCal, and I mean, we have the only Luigi's we really have are uh, Elegant and Concon. Don't see him face off against Sonic too often since. Now we do here at FPF, like you said, since uh, we get the San Diego crew coming out, but we're about to learn. <laughs> yes, we are. And, and Luigi definitely has the tools to deal with Sonic. Yeah, but Sonic does have a lot of options to get out of combo. Like his, oh, not a lot of options, but his spring can get him out of some of the combos that Luigi yeah. has. But <laughs> at the exact same time, Luigi has his Nair, which is just a lot of priority, a lot of damage. Kill power at some percents, and it comes out three frames. That's so fast. Woo. And Elegant doing a really good job of just playing patience and shielding the there spin dash and getting nice the punish. <laughs> great, great punish. Elegant's like, what about me playing well? I'll show you what playing well is. All right. Really good recovery, actually. Yeah, avoiding the spring altogether. Not getting caught up by it. And once again, using that Nair as a tool to get out of the combos, and just like that, that was like four hits. He's at 61%. Woo, but across the stage. Giving him the fist. There you go, seeing, just as you mentioned, up being out of any potential follow-up that Luigi could have had there. Alright. Ooh! Barely stuffed out that back air, throwing that Nair. Scary situation, he air dodged, but once again, yeah. that Nair! Nair coming through. Got the MVP right now. He's really, really fishing for something to kill. And something about the spin dash in neutral at this percent is if Sonic becomes careless, Luigi does. Oh my god. He does have in uh, inborn frames on that up smash. So if Phoenix gets careless with the spin dash, that might just lose in the stock. But he does know this. He does play against so many Sonics. I mean, so he does play against Luigi's with the down smash. Oh. Ah. That's two down smashes to take the set. I mean, not the Yeah, set, two the down smash kills. To take the game, yeah. yeah. Wow. <laughs> what's uh, what's Elegant's tag there about his little uh, just spam? <laughs> just spam. I mean, he started the game by just clicking B just spam six. <laughs> six what? It says oh just spam six. Just spam six. I don't know what that means. Oh, press six, everyone. Make Elegant happy. Six. Everybody, press six in the chat. That's what that's what he's telling you. Just spam six. That's all, all right. you gotta do. So we're going to go to FD. Uh, not too sure if this actually benefits Sonic a lot in this matchup, but I know it's in general, it's it's a pretty decent stage for Sonic. Yeah, he has a lot of room to run. Yeah. Oh my. But at the same time, there's much better stages like Dreamland and Duck Hunt. I mean, I don't know. This is the man who is very dedicated to the Sonic, but he knows a lot more than I do. Phoenix playing with extreme patience this game, but still Elegant's gonna play with even more patience. He's just gonna wait from the other side of stage, throwing fireballs. Yeah, Phoenix is playing a much more patient game. I think it's yeah, it must be that just all this room he has to run around, there's no platforms that he can get sharked yeah. in it's, it's just a it's a very honest game there's no shenanigans that can really happen i mean it's still luigi so shenanigans can still right, happen right. but a lot less shenanigans can happen on stages like this yeah so he, you definitely see an, a shift in uh phoenix play style Playing a much more optimal Ooh. Sonic at this point. Yeah, he is not letting Luigi just have the best of all these combos. And I think he's he's sort of given... Oh, this might actually be a... 
No, what am I talking about? Uh, he's sort of given up on all these strings that aren't guaranteed because he knows that if it's not guaranteed, Luigi will throw at that Nair and win the yes, exchange. exactly. And even if they trade, Luigi will most likely get more damage considering that Nair does like 13% with a strong hit. Whew, that almost kills. Getting something to start. I'm surprised he didn't go for the down B actually. Elegant loves to do that uh, pretty bad down throw down, down B. All right. So what Phoenix is going to want to know right now is that if he uh, approaches in with spin dash uh, on the ground, Elegant could potentially just uh, do a uh, up B out of shield. Yeah, and that down smash is going to trade and almost take Phoenix stock. He does have maximum rage. So Phoenix absolutely has to be careful. Oh! Okay, F smash. Woo! Plain and simple. Yo, get this man some lettuce because he is on a chopping spree. Just taking that man's first stock. Elegant is looking really, really well. Really good. In a good position considering all this range. I don't have no idea what I'm saying anymore. <laughs> Let's just move on. You have, your, right. you, have, you have some words you want to say because <laughs> yeah. I can't. I can't words. Well, F smash for F smash. <laughs> As things tend to go. Bringing the game back to even. Yes, indeed. You know, half. Three minutes on the clock. Been... Might be in here for the long haul. I mean, Elegant is starting to get something started. <laughs> I can't words today. He's getting <laughs> something started with a few grabs. But as usual, Phoenix has been really patient, just going in and then springing away. Did he just dash that? We we did. We take those, and uh, Phoenix has even the game all the way back up, but with two hits. Elegant is starting to take a lead, and Phoenix needs to really be careful. Okay, I'm liking these power shields right here, showing them. I can, you can throw fireballs all you want, but I'm just gonna shield them. And I'm gonna. Wow. I'm, I'm only gonna approach when you stop. <laughs> That was actually some phenomenal perfect shield. Is that gonna Ooh, yep. Wow. That thing, you know, you can't combo it into it into yeah. it anymore. It's not guaranteed down throw into cyclone, but you know, if you if you catch someone in that cyclone that close the to the top, top of the last stage. zone, yep, yeah, you're gonna probably gonna get a kill. Yeah, elegant doing a phenomenal job of spacing, well, not spacing, but just being aware of the situation and saying, hey, you're halfway up the top of the screen. I'm gonna click this button and hit it like six more times, and then you're dead up the top. So, amazing so, catch by Elegant. Game three, total advantage in Elegant's favor. He's going to sit under this platform, throw some more fireballs. He's just spamming fireballs. He just, <laughs> he just nared twice in a row. He traded nares with Sonic and then just nared again out of it. He's literally just clicking A at this point. So once again, we see that patient playstyle come through for Phoenix, nice. but the fireball gonna confirm into the grab and almost looking like pre pass Luigi. Down throw down, be almost killing. Yeah, and you know, <laughs> Elegant has to have a bit of a read on, on Phoenix. I mean, he's so far, he's winning pretty dominantly in this set. And to get someone with a down throw cyclone, you just, it's not guaranteed anymore. You, you must know where your opponent's going. Yes, indeed, he's jabs. Jab Clash is going to send him off stage. Oh, see, that's what I'm talking about. Phoenix really needs to be careful because he, if he has two kills with that spin dash, that up smash will absolutely beat it and take the stock of this percent. Oh, unfortunate stuff for Elegant, but no. still living. The misfire actually putting him in the range where he could get up aired, but not enough percent on him to get the kill for Phoenix. Yeah, that's Elegant yeah. is just fishing for that up smash, knowing that the spin dash is coming. But he's trying to get through it. But Phoenix waiting until the up smash is completed its animation to actually let go of the spin dash. Yeah, that's one thing that Phoenix is doing well. He's he's respecting the up smash, but he's not letting it take away from the spin dash. He's not saying, "Oh, you have up smash, I'm gonna stop altogether." He's just using it smarter, and he's waiting for the up smash to come out and then activating the spin dash. Oh, beautiful mash. Phoenix is so good at mashing. 
We haven't seen that as of recently, but if you know anything about this man, he mashes so quick to throw. Woo. Yeah, takes it off the top. With that high percent, Rage on Sonic. Okay. <laughs> Elegant gonna take a second to recollect himself. And really thinking about life. Trying to figure out if he has homework due next weekend. He's like, <laughs> do I, I think I have an S? No, we're good. Going back into the match. And Phoenix has racked up okay, a good Ooh. Oh, Okay, grabs. Yeah, Phoenix. Yeah, see, he, Phoenix is just waiting out the up smash every time. And that Cyclone will take the slot. Charlie is popping up in the back. I'm not entirely sure why. It was Taunt just a Cyclone. Coming out <laughs> from <laughs> Elegant, too. Oh, wow. Okay. That's not Mario. Woo. That was actually that guaranteed. Was that was string, yeah. And he's just extending it. Elegant, super hot fire. Matt Elegant is in the building. He brought that back from a 78% deficit to a dead even game. A single string. That's that's the power of Luigi, man. And most of it was guaranteed because he got that push off the platform thing. Yeah. That was insane. Charlie running over. You could see that in the player cam. He's he's excited about this match. Elegant is just playing pace on the platform. Not exactly where you want to be against the Phonics. Uh, Phonics. Uh, Sonics. Sonic. But he's keeping it there. Maybe he's looking for down throw up down B. Like on the top platform. It'd probably connect with this percent and it might actually kill. <laughs> Phoenix definitely not going to give it to him. Yeah, this is his last life. I mean, his last limbs. If he loses this stock, he's in losers. Okay, Cyclone not gonna kill yet, but racks up the damage. Yeah, it's the maximum. Is he gonna go for another one? He's got so many kills with this, like, whoa! There it is! There yes! It is. Yeah. And I've seen him do that in wow. that same scenario, like, for three different times in that set. Yes. Yeah, it worked out. Elegant. Taking that 3 0 over Phoenix, that was. I mean, you can consider it an upset on paper as far as, like, ranking goes, but that was just. Both players played that so well. We saw so much adaptation come from Phoenix, but it's just... It could have gone either way. I mean, really, I, there were moments that Phoenix was up. He had all the momentum, but in that, especially in that last game, I mean, he it looked like Phoenix was going to take it away. Uh, you know, he was down 2-0. He didn't want to go out 3-0, so he was trying his best, and he definitely looking like he was going to take it. But Elegant manages to take that first stock, and then brings it right back with a guaranteed combo on a string.